We cannot make any more cuts to any vital services, whether it's health care, education, transit. I depend on Chicago transit system for my life. If, if I don't have it, then I can't get to work. As we stand in this lobby, I used to be a Chase customer. I am no longer a Chase customer because I cannot afford to be a Chase customer. I cannot afford to ride CTA. With my income being under the poverty level, how am I going to afford a bus pass? Public transit is on the chopping block. A report by Refund Transit being released today shows that now nearly 80% of transit agencies across the country have been forced to slash services or raise fares in order to make ends meet since the beginning of the recession. That means that riders are being forced to pay more for less service. This has an especially devastating impact on students, seniors, people with disabilities, and low-income riders who often do not have other means of transportation. We are in this mess because of toxic interest rate swaps that are making Wall Street rich at the expense of the 99%. Before the financial crash, the big banks pitched these interest rate, rate swaps to cities, states, and public agencies as a way to save money. But when the banks crashed the economy, the Federal Reserve lowered interest rates to record lows to bail them out. This mean, means that banks are able to pay close to 0% on these deals, while transit agencies are stuck paying 3 to 6%. The banks get to keep the difference as profit, which is now costing taxpayers across the country more than $2.5 billion every year.